Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu withdrew his country's negotiators from Qatar and called on hostage negotiating negotiations, saying that they had reached a dead end with Hamas. Hamas did not fulfill some of agreement, including the release of all children and women according to a list that was transmitted in approved by Hamas. Israeli Prime Minister Minter said, said, Foreign Minister Antony Blinken has been Israel on Thursdays and Fridays in Israel since the beginning of the conflict October. He accused Hamas for a fell ceasefire agreement, but also reiterated need for better thinking of the Gaza civilians of Israeli army. Thursday. Israel itself is important, he said. On Friday. I have seen Israel's plans in a wide range of ways do everything possible protect civilians. Make sure they have the information they need and adapt them. He continued. This will be very important in the future. Something we will take a closer look. Best stories from the Hill The U.S. pressure on Israel has gradually focused on how Gaza will look. After the war, while the U.S. put pressure on an independent Palestinian government, Israel officials implied that there may be some kind of military control. While fight was rising again on Saturday, the Israeli army said he had hit 400 targets in Gaza, including 50 in southern Gaza, where approximately 2 million civilians took refuge from conflict. By referring to important civilian wounded figures, pressure on the Biden administration increased to support an indefinite ceasefire in the war. Both ministration and the Israeli government rejected a long-term pause.